crispy, man. I need to play on this back nine. Nice shot. Oh! Today, you know they say the trees are 90% air, 80% air, not today. They're 100% wood today. Yeah. All right, guys, welcome back. We are on the back nine here now at Innisbrook, taking on the island course, which absolutely destroyed us on the front nine. We're playing a stroke play match. If you guys didn't check out that video, go back and check it out. This video is living up to all the hype of how hard everyone says it is. Uh -huh. But we're warmed up now. We're gonna take on this back nine. It's gonna feature a lot of those tight holes you saw on the front and we're gonna get more of that water that comes into play down the stretch. Definitely, and we're still in the middle of a match. Frank's got me by four strokes so far, and like we said before in the previous video, anything can happen on this course. Four strokes can change in one hole. We've here. seen it. In <laughs> one hole, there is water everywhere. It's a, it is a difficult track, but we've got the 10th hole here. First drive right back over the water, and we've got elevation to deal with. It's a 422 yard par four up the hill. So, no rest for the weary. Let's go. Okay, I think you're gonna be go good. Yep. Hey, talk about elevation. 206, my slope's got me playing 216, so it's 10 extra yards up this hill. We got a little wind working with us though. Yeah, we do. And you see, this is what we saw a lot on the front nine too just spots where there's just trees that will just block you out. You think you're okay, you're in a fairway. So now I just gotta, I'm gonna aim a little bit left. I don't wanna take on those trees no, you don't if I don't take have to. Them. Absolutely you know? not. Okay. Kept it left. Yeah, two left though, sit down. You know, I gotta say this because it sounds like kind of cliche, but I'm just blessed we're down here in Florida. We have a cold, cold winter up in New Jersey, 20, 30 degrees, some some weeks it was like 10 or 15. So to be able to escape a little bit, come down here and film some content for, for us, for you guys, uh, it's been a real blessing. We love doing this. So, uh, look from over here, Mike. yeah, I do have a better look from over here. Let's see what happens. I got 187 playing 203. Yeah, that sounds fun. Cleaner look though. Okay. Oh, it looks really good if it's the right distance. Bounce. It bounced on the green. I doubt it held it, but I'm happy with that. Yeah. Thanks, Frank. Stay it safe. No OB. Barely, right? Barely, man. You're in this guy's backyard. I bet this guy knows how to play this shot. Probably plays that shot every <laughs> evening, right? Yep. Yeah. I got it through. You got that rough. Just Let's just see if you hold it. Green. Yeah. Yeah, I couldn't hold it. Just rolled just off the other side. Screens are quick. If you watched our last video, you saw that. So uh, unfortunately, keeping it that low and trying to keep it under those tree branches, it just skipped across. And Mike, his hybrid uh, was a little long, so he's in the bunker behind the green here. Bite now. Yep, all right, it bit a little. You're gonna just have a long pot. Nice hands right there. Kept it below the hole. Side, Mike. I knew it was hit it. Oh. I didn't want the same thing to happen to me, and I kept on the right side. Pushed it right through. Yeah, nothing easy about this course. No, nothing easy out here. <laughs> All right, here it is, the 11th hole, the one that Mike said was the highest elevation he had heard in the county. And you see it here. Here we're up there. Uh, par 5, about 500 yards uh, from these green tees. We're going to be driving it over the road and uh, just try to get somewhere down there in that fairway and the green up there, super protected. Another huge, huge bunker. So it's just gonna be a, try to get in a decent position off the tee here. Turn it back. A little bit, not as much as I'd like. Cleared it. Oh. Good shape. Wow, yeah. <laughs> that was a hold the breath the whole time. Yeah. Clear the bunker, clear the bunker. Should be all right. Yeah, she's working back right. Really Stay out of the tree. Yep, you're good. Yeah. Good shape. Hey man, good spot. Yeah, so my slope's got me at 240. It plays like 240 up this hill. Like I said on the tee box, lots of bunkering up by that green. I'm gonna hit the three wood. I mean, I don't see any point here in laying up. If anything, the bunkers are shorter. So we're just gonna try to get this as far up there as we can. Good contact. Played a nice little draw. 
I think you're gonna be fine. I got a chance to get home in two, but again, on this course, I just wanna get home at four. <laughs> on this part time. All right, low, run it up the right side. Nothing crazy, nothing crazy. Oh, went left, but I kept it low. Run, baby, run. Yeah, I think that's gonna be just fine. All right, he's saying he's got a window here. Window? Okay. Guys, this shot's brought to you by Pella Windows and Doors. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> I mean, I think my shot here is just eight iron low. In front of the green, don't hit that trap. Don't hit that trap. Well, it stayed out of the trap. It stayed out of the trap. All By right. some miracle, it stayed out of the trap. Awesome. I'm hunting par today. Believe it or not, I haven't made a par on this course yet. Think about that. Let me That's tell how you. hard it is. I believe it. That's, That's how, hard, how it hard it is, yeah. So here's what I want you to do. If I make par at all in this video, you all need to smash likes. Likes, likes, because I'm telling you, it's that hard. This is my best chance. Let's do it. Oh, he might have it. Ooh. Yeah. Come on, right. let's go. He's up and out, and he's on. All right. All right, good stuff here. We've got some good, decent opportunities. Frank has a birdie putt uphill. I like his chances, and I got a short par putt, but that's no gimme, slippery. All right, let's see if we can get a birdie. One of us, one of us has got to make a par here, okay? You got it, come we on. We can do this. I definitely feel a par from one of us. I like it. Ah, a little more pace, man. Well, at least we got our par. Get a par there. Pars feel so good out here oh, wow yeah i know right all right this would be a big pick me up two pars on this hole let's see mike drop this one there Oops. you go slippery there you go all right man there it is hit it let's go all right so this hole's only 300 if you want to get super aggressive you could try to go over the trees and take it about you got about 250 to the end of the fairway but you don't want to go any further left than that. That's OB, it's houses. So okay. it's an aggressive line. if it fades line. back right, you're, you're okay. Then you're okay. However, if you go too far, the trees straight out that we see in the distance uh -huh. are 221. Ah, uh, it's too close. All right. Yeah, so it's just too close. I think the smartest play is to put something. But the other thing too is you got to make sure you get out far enough that you're not blocked out by the trees on the left. Okay. So uh, I, and 195 shot is perfect. It leaves you 136 in. So 195 is your wheelhouse. Got it. All right, Caddy Frank right there, helping us out with this hole. Guys, if you haven't checked out Precision Pro, check it out. They got some great products. The R1 Smart Range Finder, Ace Speaker. We have a lot of fun with it. And they got some new products coming out too, so stay tuned for that on the channel. A lot of giveaways coming. All right, let's keep the par train going, or at least let's start a train. A little too left. Come on, sit down. Even trying to play very conservatively, can't tell you how tight and the little margins for error. So even get it a little bit left and that all those trees come in. So keep it right, Mike. Don't don't do what I did. Yeah, all right. That's nice. That's nicely played. Yeah. That's what I wanted to do. Yeah. All right. So as you can see from the air, this green is protected. It's well protected by bunkers. I got 152 to the middle. I hit a nine iron. Let's see if we can avoid everything. Just put it right in the middle of the green. Off the left side. Uh, here's Frank's ball, and that's where he's gone. <laughs> I think the most <laughs> difficult thing about this course is it doesn't let you get away with even the slightest miss. That's right. And yeah. we're only talking about being about 15 yards left of fairway here, and this is what we got. All I can do, I think I'm gonna play a little bit of a ground game here. I'm gonna take this four iron and just punch it really low and just try to get it clear of the trees, and from there we'll we'll worry about it after that. This could be the most epic shot in golf, or the most epic fail, but we'll see. I'm more confident in the first one. I think you got a good shot here. Just keep it low. Oh, it dude, was so, so close. close to being good. So it was close. So close. Hit it right where the line I wanted. Just caught that last trick. All right, let's go up there. Yes, get out. Up and over. Up and no. over. There. All right, man. That's what these, these trees will eat you up. Yeah, you just you piece together holes on this course. Yeah. <laughs> you just it's like a puzzle. You piece it all together. Nice shot. The, it's the compounding effect. Like one missed tee shot, and then you've got yeah. the rest of the hole is a struggle, you right. know? Right, yeah, I felt that many times today. I read that entirely to break this way. And it didn't, it, it held the line, it didn't break it off. Get it. Oh. Oh. Would have been nice two pars in a row. Would have been nice. It would have been really nice. 
Have we had a par three with a one handle on it today? No, there's been no like little pitch shot par oh. threes. Okay, 178, playing 185. Okay. Up the hill, into the wind. Into the wind, got yeah. it. This hole is also super protected in front with a deep lipped green side bunker, causing you to really want to make sure you get it up there, that elevated green. Okay, a little right. Chunk. A little chunky on that. And you know what that is? It's when that wind got in my head in the last minute, I tried to rip it. Yeah, you tried to that's rip my, it. That's always my miss, yep. always. Yep. So that miss you just saw is exactly what I recently worked on with Ryan Hager. You can get a chance to check out that video. Definitely check it out. The, uh, the biggest thing for me is when I feel like I don't have enough club, in that case it was the wind, I get out of sequence. Get the yep. top moving too fast. So Ryan's working with me at sequencing the lower. It just doesn't happen every time. I'm still working it into my swing. And when I miss, this is what happens. So we came up way short. We're about 50 yards still short here to that pin in the back. So I got a little 52. It's a good looking shot. A little spin action up there. Oh yeah. Too much. It's feel like it stopped it, huh? Let's stopped go, man. Short. All right, we're potting. We got an uphill pot. Yeah. All right, Mike's tee shot's just to the right of the green here. Tried to get too cute and bladed it. I wanted to just finesse it on And he bladed place. it. Ooh, he almost dunked it. Almost. Hey, I said it before and I'll say it again. Feel around the greens is the first thing that goes in the winter. First rounds back on the course. Just gotta get that out of the system. Ooh. Yeah, that hill really pushed it. Yep. Not a bad stroke. <laughs> At that point, I had nothing to lose. All right, let's go. Definitely no course records for me today. <laughs> Who am I kidding? I'm just happy to survive this course. This is a course you just survive. Great shot. Finally a drive that felt good today. It's okay. left. Turning away, it never turns. Got okay, pine straw. All right, Mike is left here, but might be left enough that he's got actually a look here. 173, just playing it from this kind of waste area sand. All right, but we can see the flag. Oh. It was gonna be online and great and everything. Today, you know they say the trees are 90% air, 80% air, not today. They're 100% wood today. Yeah. Frank's in that primo real estate spot. Look at this. Uh-huh, uh-huh. So we got 170, but my slope 173. Wind is taking off just 80% of a yard. <laughs> so yeah. like Bryson. Yeah, right. But I'm, yeah, 173, we're gonna play it. Okay. That R1, we actually did a whole video on it. It's incredible. It takes the weather into account when it gives you the plays like number. Crispy, man. Got a game to play on this back nine. Might have wow, came up okay. a little short, but I mean, Look good. All right, what's the play here? <laughs> Just gonna try Players, to. Don't break an ankle in that little hole there. That's first. Number and one. Miles. Number two. One forty-eight. I mean, it's not a window. That's yeah, not... it's like unless you could play some sort of. I mean, this is Mike's look here. Unless you could play some sort of like big old draw. I mean. You know what? It would have to turn. If it doesn't turn, it's in that guy's uh, outdoor We're kitchen. We're not playing for records, so you know what? Let's go for it. All right, just turn it. Close those shoulders down. Play a hard draw. I mean, it's got to be like a hook draw. Like a bubba at the match. This is not like a buttery draw. I this gotta is, turn this thing. This over. is a hook draw. You got to play here. If I don't, it's, it's in that guy's outdoor kitchen. Got it. He's cooking up some burgers though. It's drawn. It just clipped the tree. Okay. Over the trap. Over the trap. But there's another trap. There's two traps. I'm, all right, I'm, that's okay. All right, a little short like we thought, but not bad. Yeah, you know, I swung it easy. I'm just, I'm putting a super priority on just trying to keep things on line, even mm -hmm. if you come up short. Because the good news is here, I got this nice little run up. I can Texas wedge it. Okay, let's see it happen. Everything's gonna break left pretty hard, huh? Oh yeah. I like that play. I really like that play a lot. Checked it up a little more than I would have liked, but the line I wanted. Got a tweener here We're in between both bunkers. Thought I ended up in the second one, but hey. Hey, I'm pin high. Pin high. Yeah. All right. Remember how fast these greens are gonna be. Yep. Uh, they, I should say how fast they've been. 
Yeah. So uh, it's going to release when you hit the green. I would just maybe carry it a yard on if you can. If you can, I know we're struggling today, but you got this. We we got to think positive. It's all positive vibes out here, dude. Let's see if I can get you. See, I like the distance you hit it. It was just left. Yeah, I just pulled it a little bit. I yanked it, but that's fine. Again, let's stay positive. Anything we can. Right. At least we're putting uphill, right? It did go dead straight. Yeah, straight. That was my line. Yep. Jeez. All right, Frank's got a par attempt. We like par attempts on the island course. Nah, nah you gotta get it up the hill though, Frank. Get up the hill, Frank. still gotta get it up the hill, you know what I mean? All right, bogey. 15th hole here, it's a par five, it's 515, and again, it's tight. So it's just a matter of hitting at least two good shots here, yeah. probably three good shots to be on the screen. Okay, here we go. I keep going left again. Swung that like, a billion mile an hour baseball swing. I did. But I, I see it over there. Yeah. yeah we're good. That's how you do it. Stay out of that trap. Stay out of that trap. Yeah. The story continues. Not only too is it narrow, but again, fairway bunkers everywhere. This one's got a huge lip, so there's nothing I can really do except take my medicine. I'm gonna hit a pitching wedge and just try to get to the fairway. But if you can hit a good tee shot to right about here and take on these two right and left fairway bunkers it does slope down and you can run down and give yourself a good look at this in two. But unfortunately, I did not get that lucky. We gotta have to just wedge it out. <laughs> All right. Yep. You ran it down there. Let it run down. Would have liked to have been there with my drive, but. I know. Coulda, woulda, shoulda, right? All right. Yeah. That much from a re -tee, so counting my blessings here. 311, just gonna hit an iron back to that fairway for like a hundred shot, would be great. Flirted with the trees and ended up really nice. Paid off. All right. Good strike, man. Good strike. I think you're going to be in great shape up there. That should be good. Maybe yep. caught a piece of that green, maybe? What do we have here? If you purchase the Bubba Drive, hit your second shot from here. Yeah. Why didn't we purchase the Bubba Drive, Frank? <laughs> it made our lives so much easier. Right. If only we knew we could have purchased the Bubba Drive. Be enough. Yep, you're on. I'm on. Splashed in my eye. Yeah. Woo. Our Frank guy likes lucky here. Look at this. Calls it luck. I call it skill. <laughs> okay. The shot was skill, but not yeah. going in there. Before. Lucky to not go in there. And but he's got a shot. The reason why I'm starting to rip a little because we've got four holes to go, and he's up by four strokes in this match. So he's oh. got to dig in. <laughs> but take a look here. You can see we've got an incredibly narrow green on this long par five. It is only maybe 10 yards wide. So it's another thing that makes this, this hole particularly difficult. But I'm here in three, even having to wedge it out of that fairway bunker. And Mike is there in three putting for birdie. So let's see if we can get this on, keep it respectable. Check. Oh, woo, we gave it a little much. It's such a narrow green. It is so narrow. All right, birdie putt up the hill, a little left to right breaker. Man, I hit it a little on the toe. Pushed it right. Okay. Bogey's here on the island course. Feel like pars. This would be good here to get one back. To go uh, down three strokes with three to play. That's what I need. Oh, we ah. wimped out on it. Wimp, 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 wimp. All right, 16th hole. These are longer here on the back. We've got another 437 yard par four and it is tight. Like I keep saying, I feel like a broken record. Not only is it a tight fairway that's lined on both sides by those fairway bunkers like you saw in that last hole, fairway bunker, I had to just wedge it out. Um, so just trying to put together a semi-respectable score here. It has been a tough day, but we got a couple more holes to play, so let's see what we can do. Nice shot. Broadway, Mike. Broadway, baby. Broadway. Right down Broadway. Right down the pipe. Right. Well, the good news is, although it's tight, that's just another fairway over there. All right, this might be the first time on this course where you can hit a bad shot and get away with it because there's another fairway here. So Mike's actually got us a look at this green playing the opposite fairway. Let's see what he does. He's got a hybrid. Get through. 
Oh. Right on line too. Yep. All right, 200 on the number, but I just fired it 219. The pin is all the way in the back and it's like a shoot here. Left side, tree and water, right side tree. You really gotta keep it straight. <laughs> I'm gonna hit the hybrid here and just kinda hope to keep it as online as possible. All right, I like that play. Yeah, look at this, he's not kidding. Dude, that's money. You're making registers ring everywhere. Let's go, get on. All right, good news is you still gotta look from over here. Uh, I think those trees are not in play because you got plenty to get up and over them. You don't wanna be long here though. Yeah. I play that middle number, 160. That's my number, Yeah. Wait, aren't. Yep, that should be good. That should be on the left side of the green. Yep, you're putting. All right, remember, this is a long par four, 430 yards. Mike is here in three, just short, right? Three? I'm here in three, and you scared me when you said it was a par four. I thought it was a par five. That's how long this thing is. Yeah. Wow. And you're on it, too. Beautiful. Okay. Let's go. Settle, right? Might have been my... Uh... Best hybrid shot of the day there. I think so, man. For as, as tough as it is and as, I don't know, not well as we've been playing this round, it feels good to, to do two good shots in a row, good drive, good uh, hybrid here. But we still got a long way. This is a this is a tough hole. It is. This birdie putt is like a 0.1% big <laughs> percentage from here. I just want to lag it close, really. Okay. That's not bad at all. It's a good line, you just needed more pace up the hill. Get it, get it, get it. Oh. Oh, I definitely thought it would break. I know, so did I. This course does not give you anything. No. Three putt bogey. So Frank's up eight strokes with two to play. Oof. Think I got a chance? Yeah, you know. He could put it in the water here, and then he could put it in the water again six more times on 18. Thanks, guys. <laughs> <You> can... <laughs> we didn't want you to hear all that. Thanks, guys. I'm right here. Oh, man. Sometimes you got to have a little fun out here, right? I mean, that's really what this game is all about. You guys are special. You guys are just good friends. He's probably not going to give me a number now. Yeah, I shouldn't. Yeah. But it is 178. That's going to be hard to beat with shots like that. Go in the hole. Just go in the hole. Ooh. And I'm going to tell you something. I played more club. Really? And I was a little bit short. Now that looks good. Just turning a little on you. That's what you want. Not halfway. Not quite halfway. Go, it's got to catch go, that hill. Go. Oh. I think it, I, I think it is. No. I, I just don't it's get it. It's straight. I don't get it. It's weird. It's straight. <laughs> All right, that uh, that last putt really, really fooled us. I'll tell you, even the greens don't let up out here because uh, after watching my first putt and Mike's putt, it looked so much like it moved right. So I aimed left side and it stayed there. It was straight. Mm -hmm. That one's that one got in the brain. That's yeah, for yeah. sure. I'm just excited this is 18. <laughs> uh, this is by far, I'm telling you right now, the hardest course. I know we've said it, but now that we're on the 18th, it definitely is. Uh, we're nine strokes apart. You got this one. I think you're going to go up 2-1 in the matches, which is cool. We got two more rounds. Two more rounds. I could still win this best of five series. Uh, but again, it's not over, actually. This one does look scary. Nine strokes. It's a lot, but stay confident. Okay. <laughs> All right, this course is not going to quit on us. Down to the last hall. Another challenging shot placement type Hole. So it's not incredibly long, only 312. However, all water up the left side, it's a hard dog leg left. You've got to get it out far enough to get past those trees so you're not blocked out and you've got to look into this green. However, you also can't go too far. Bunkers come into play, the woods come into play. So I think we're both hitting the same shot here. We're going to try to hit about a 200 yard shot, right? Yeah, let's go. We've got to get it past that tree line, otherwise, you're going to be blocked out. chunky but you'll get away with that i'll get away with it all right i see what you were saying i mean i got chunky off the the tee so i'm completely blocked out here the play was to get it a little bit further you're going to be in, in great shape there i can't go over here 
So there's water everywhere up there. I'm just gonna try to get it down there a little bit. That's it, just punch it out past where you can start to see the green. Oh, don't get held up. Yeah, it's just a rough held it up. Gosh. I think you're gonna have a luck, you have a luck. Yeah. This is a tough one. It's 160, 169, really. But the wind is coming at me. Mm -hmm. I think the safest play is that left side of the green and try to let it go down this way. Yeah, because don't right mess is with so the right. Much trouble. If you miss left, it's fine. Right. But you got to get it there, you know? 164 playing 165. Okay. Yeah, yeah, that's exactly what you wanted, man. I want that left side of the green. Okay. All right. I think it's on there. I think Tough so. to see, but I think it's on Tough there. Tough to see, but I did hear a thud. Yeah. I think the one thing that I definitely want to say here is I don't want how tough it's been out here and how tough we've been talking about it to discourage anyone from playing it. I think one important thing is the reason we love this game is the challenge and every once in a while you want one of these courses that is just so hard and just gives you a little perspective and tests parts of your game because you learn and you grow as a golfer from this. Like we know some shots that we need to learn to hit after today. All right, we're checking on Mike here. He's got a look now. He can see that pin. Oh, nice. Come on, catch a piece. Yep. Yeah. Back right. There you go. Okay, cool. You're still putting for par. It's a long putt, but you're still putting for par. Yeah, let's see if it stayed on. All right, we both got on. I yeah. stayed on over there, and you're down there, so tail you're in two a good different spots. I got a long yeah, you got, putt. Got a couple of zip codes to get through. I mean, how far left are you aiming here? Jeez. I know. You got to think it's going to push it hard right, right. Yeah, I think so. Wasn't, I wasn't as high as I wanted to be. That's a tough green. Yeah, it's a tough. I wanted to be up above Jeez. that leaf and I was below it. Yep. Yeah, I want to be high. Look, that's yeah. gone. Come on. You don't realize how high you have to be where this pin is. Good two putt. Thanks. Good bogue. Right through it. Right ah. through it, man. Didn't want to end the boat. I know. Island course in the books. Three pot. Ah. All right, so I did not break 100. I shot a 106, you shot a 95. You broke 100. So, dude, great match. You're up 2-1. I don't think I've shot over 100 in years. <laughs> so, I mean, that's how difficult it is. But anyway, guys, thanks for sticking in. I mean, this is as real as we get. It was a tough course, and we've got plenty more golf down here in Florida. We've got two more matches. Four more videos, including Copperhead tomorrow, where the PGA Tour plays the Valspar, and then TPC Tampa Bay. Thanks again. We'll see you there.